All right, now we're gonna talk about smoky quartz. Smoky quartz is quartz that has that smoky gray color, brown color to it. If it's super dark, like this one where it's completely opaque, you can't see any light through there at all, it's called Morion. Sometimes smoky quartz gets phantoms in there. You can see the outline of, of previous crystal shapes inside there. I'm, it's a little difficult to see, but uh, they're in there. Citrine is a special variety of smoky quartz. It's just smoky quartz that uh, did not get as much uh, radiation into it. What causes smoky quartz is you get a little bit of aluminum that's replacing some of the silicon uh, molecules in here. So when, they, when they, that happens and there's a little bit of radiation, uh, gamma radiation, so pretty intense radiation, but even at low levels, it, it causes the, uh, the, the smoky color in there. Now, this has to happen at a temperature of less than 50 degrees Celsius, which is about 120 degrees Fahrenheit. So it's not hot water or hot solutions in here that when it does that, it's, it's actually quite cool and calm when the radiation is making this happen. It, it's been estimated that the radiation to make the smoky quartzes like this uh, dark like that, it can take millions of years. They can measure those very specifically. Same with this, you can see that the smoky is in here in layers and phantoms. Each one of those phantoms is where the crystal grew, stopped, started, stopped, started, stopped, started, and then eventually terminated. The, uh, and each one of those, at the top of each of those uh, phantoms in there, it received more radiation, and that's what caused it to be, uh, the, the phantom to stand out a little darker on each, each uh, tip. My favorite use for smoky quartzes is obviously going to be gemstones. Here's a couple a smoky quartz, and uh, uh, this is a, a citrine. The citrine is natu or not naturally uh, colored, that's um, artificial radiation. Historically, uh, smoky quartz from Brazil has been sm sold as smoky topaz. Don't be confused when you're buying it and you see smoky topaz. It's not really topaz, it's smoky quartz. Mm -hmm. Smoky quartz uh, tends to almost always form in uh, granites where uh, you have granites that have uh, natural radiation sources like uranium and thorium trapped inside the, the granite itself. And then these grow in what's called pegmatites or hollow cavities where they have free space to grow. Thanks for watching. These videos are brought to you by our real estate business, uh, the Crystal Barista, the Collectible Real Estate, and Gym Quality Real Estate, all empowered by the Stern team at Keller Williams Real Estate. If you like this video, like and subscribe below for more videos coming. We will have more coming about rocks, gems, minerals, fossils, and lapidary. Thanks.